All right, so let's look at this um, homework for Bridges Math Grade 4. And we're going to start with modeling multiplication and division number one and two. So take a look at this uh, little grid, <clears throat> and you can see that we have five rows um, and four columns. So in total, it would be how much? And your problem will be 5 times 4 equals whatever. <clears throat> Here, they're giving us the um, number of squares that are filled in. So we'll start with that. So 3, 6, 9, 12, 15. We have 18 there. And we're dividing it <clears throat> into um, this many rows. And then the answer is going to be, they gave us already, is 3. <clears throat> so that should be simple. Um, but then you have to choose one of these two and come up with a story for it. So, for example, something like this. I had 18 pieces of paper. I put them equally into six folders. How many papers were in each folder? But, of course, come up with your own story. Don't just copy mine. And then here we have an open number line and a ratio table. I think we're familiar enough with these that you should be able to fill those out. <clears throat> simply let's take a look at some of the um, stories here this is an interesting one so mr. stills class had music for 50 minutes and then independent reading for 20 minutes music starts at 8 30 what time does mr. stills class finish independent reading <clears throat> so basically you need to think about what is um, how much is that time you have 50 minutes plus 20 minutes, right? So that's gonna give you 70 minutes. But the tricky thing with time though, is can you split that into <clears throat> hours in minutes? Okay, so how many hours are in, or how many minutes are in an hour? It is 60, so that'd be one hour in 10 minutes. So it's later than this, so basically I'd take <clears throat> 8.30, and add another hour and 10 minutes, and that will give you your answer. And be sure to um, show an equation, something like this, and answer with a sentence too. So this like finished reading at blah, blah, blah. Okay, down here, um, we've got a similar one. Mr. Ford's class starts art at 9.30 and finishes at 10.15. Okay, so if art is that long, how many minutes is art? And again, we're working with time here, so we can't, we have to remember, you're gonna have basically 30 minutes plus 15 minutes to get to 1015. So it looks like 45 minutes for art. <clears throat> and then they spend twice as much time in math class. So math is going to be what? two times 45 they start math at 110 <clears throat> what time do they finish math so again similar 110 and then whatever you get here convert into hours and minutes and add it up and that's what time they will finish math uh, for the answer <clears throat> so just sort it out and then again write a sentence uh, try to do an equation if you can figure one out. And that is it for this. Thank you and goodbye.